guys. So, first things first. I'm trying something new the way that I set my camera up. So, or my phone, whatever. Um, so that may be that you guys could see me better and see what I'm talking about. And I talk with my hands. Um, so, um, I am going to show you guys, um, what I have got from Ulta. Um, I've made two trips to Ulta in the past, um, oh no. Well, two trips to Ulta in the past two weeks and I also went, um, a few weeks ago um, with a girlfriend of mine and if I see that stuff I've already put that stuff away um, but if I see that stuff sitting here I'll pull it out and I'll show you um, okay so we're gonna start with Ulta and if we have time I'll show you what I've gotten from Target or I might put that in another I'll probably have to put that in another video Okay, so, first thing, this is right in front of me. I got this a couple weeks ago. Um, this is the new um, e.l.f. Super Hydrate Moisturizer. Um, and I have been using a gel moisturizer um, from Pharmacy, and I love it. Um, but, it's pretty pricey um so I kind of wanted to try to see if I could find something else that I really enjoyed um so here is the container it's pretty big this is here this is the pharmacy that I've been using um so it's pretty um I'm probably twice the size um but I like using my moisturizer um in the morning and then in the night um and then this is just what it looks like um, and it's just, it's pretty much just a jelly form. Um, and I'm, a little will go a long, 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 long way. Um, so I'll probably be using this for quite a while. So I don't look to be purchasing any more moisturizers for a while. Um, but if you all have something in mind that is a dupe for the pharmacy, um, I'll try it. Or maybe if the pharmacy goes back on sale, I'll probably buy it again. Um, but yes, I got that. Um, the next thing I got was, um, and keep in mind for, um, the two orders that I've gotten in the past two weeks, I did pickup orders and, um, I struggle with matching concealers and foundations and things like that online. So I haven't used this yet. This is the, um, Kali Cosmetics um, Concealer. Um, I got it in the shade Sand. Um, and this is what the, um, packaging looks like. It's pretty sleek. I like it. Um, and I'm just gonna pop a little right there. It looks, it doesn't look too terrible. I'm just gonna blend it in. Okay, it's not bad. It's a little light. But that's okay because I like to brighten my under eyes because I brightened my under eyes this morning and you see what they look like now. Um, they are, I don't, I struggle with my under eyes. I don't know why. Oh well. So yeah, that's what it looks like when it blends out. You can't really see it, but you can tell that there's coverage right there in that area. Um, so, oh, it smells nice. I like that. Um, another thing that I got, <laughs> okay, another thing that I got was this SA CeraVe for, um, rough and bumpy skin. I got this to use on my arms right here or right in here. I have it on the other side as well. And if you can't tell, um, and I have it a little bit right here. If you can't tell what that is, um, a lot of people struggle from it. It's, um, Keratos Polaris, and, um, I have not been to the dermatologist, but I have contacted a few dermatologists, and they have all suggested this. So, I've been using it. It's probably half gone. Um, I usually try my hardest to use it in the morning and at night, but, like I said, I try my hardest. 
Another thing that I got was this Essie um, nail lacquer and it is in the shade Bikini So Teeny and I got this um, to actually match um, a set of nails that I got um, and I'll show you those in a minute. Um, but I have this on my toes right now and it is so cute. It's so cute with a tan skin and um, it dries really quick. Um, this is like only the second bottle of Essie I've ever used. Um, I normally don't spend that much on nail polish, but I really like it. I do recommend that. Um, this was something that I was super excited about. Um, and I've only used it once and I think I've been let down, but I don't know. I'm going to try it a few more times. Um, I got the Too Faced Lip Injection Extreme. And let me just tell you, it smells awful. Um, it smells, it smells bad. Um, but it did say on the directions, um, for five to ten minutes, you could ex experience intense tingle sensation on your lips. And I did, and they started to plump up, um, and then, I don't know, it just went away pretty quick. Now, I do have Grande Lips, and this is a um, hydrating lip plumper, and I feel like this one lasts a little bit longer than the lip injection. Um, but, like I said, I'll try it a few more times and see kind of how it turns out. Um, let's see what else. Oh, I got these. Um, I got these from Ulta as well. They are the, um, LA Girl Perfected, Perfect per Precision. Blech. And, um, this one is in the shade Bear. And I'll swatch it for you. I didn't realize when I bought these. I bought these in store. Um, when I went with a girlfriend and I didn't realize that they're just not what I wanted. Like, you see the big difference in these pinks. This pink does not look good on me. It looks like a little girl's makeup. I've been thinking about giving it to my girls, actually. And then this, I've had a color similar to this and I loved it. Um, actually, I think it's this one. It's from Ace, um, Ace Beauty, so it's pretty similar, um, but where I'm tan now, it just kind of blended in with my whole face, and it just, I don't, I don't know. I'm the type of person that likes to wear a lip liner all over my lips, and then maybe apply a gloss or an oil over top of them, um, but these were just... They're, they're good quality. Don't get me wrong. These are really good quality lip liners. The colors weren't it. So. Um, let's see what else. Okay. Um, I got this NYX. This is supposed to be a dupe for the Anastasia one. Um, the NYX The Brow Glue. And it just comes in a little tube like this. And it has the spoolie. I think the the um, the formula is very thick. It could be a bit thinner, but I want to say it was eight dollars, maybe. So it wasn't that expensive, and I really do like it because sometimes I like the wispy brows. Obviously, today I do not have the wispy brows because I needed to hurry, and it takes me a while to do wispy brows. Okay, so another thing that I got. Um, okay, I don't really see anything sitting there. I'm not going to take too long. Um, okay. This is what I picked up yesterday, and I think everything's still in there. Yes. Okay. So, i right here. That's probably really loud. I got... I got two of the um, Big Sexy Hair Dry Shampoos, 
and um, I watched it. I seen a TikTok that these are actually pretty good. Um, I got two of them because they're only 3.4 ounces, and I'm used to a bottle about this size. This is the, um, I don't know how you pronounce it. I'm not even going to pronounce it, but that's the brand. Um, I'm not crazy about this one. Don't really recommend unless you just want it for fragrance. Um, but I got two of these because they're 3.4 ounces and they were buy one get one half off. So I got two of those. I haven't used them yet. These are the nails. Okay. They don't match the Essie at all like I thought they would. Not at all. So, but that's, that's okay because I still really like the Essie. I'm a little disappointed about the nails because I thought they were going to be more this color that's on the packaging and not darker. Like, they're a little bit darker, but I got these for Easter, um, and, uh, I'm going to put them on probably today. Um, I have been using these nails for a little bit now. It's the, um, Impress by Kiss nails. Um, I've bought several colors, and these are by far my favorite they um are they do come with it says no glow needed they come with the um the glue pads or the sticker pads or whatever inside the nails already um but i use both i bought an, a really good nail glue and um so i use both um if you want me to do a nail video i might i might do one of those the next thing i got um, I had actually got something different than this, and, um, my girlfriend was like, um, I just had that in my cart, and now it's gone, and I was like, it's probably because I bought the last one. Um, so I told her to get me this on her order, and we would just flip-flop. Um, so I originally ordered the Tree Hut Bare Minimum, um, Skin bare hair minimum skin lotion whatever it's called um but she really wanted that so I got this um it is the tree hut sugar scrub and this is in the scent coconut lime um I got this mainly to help scrub off my um self tanner but also to just use on occasion I love the smell of it I wanted the Coca Colada, but of course, it's sold out like everywhere. Don't even have any intentions of buying that because you're not going to get it. Unless you order it online. And then the last... Yeah. The last thing that I got was this uh, CeraVe Foaming Facial Cleanser. Right now, I am using the um, Elf Jelly Bounce Back Cleanser. Um, and I really like it. I just like changing up my facial cleansers, um, just because my skin gets so used to things and I just, I like changing them up and I figured I would try this because I've not tried this before. So, um, I think that's, yeah, that's all I got from Ulta. Um, so I'll just save the Target stuff for another video and I thank you guys for watching. If you have any, um, suggestions of things I should try or do you have any questions, I could tell you what I use or whatever. Um, I might do a video later on of my favorite products, um, as of right now and I'll see you next time. Bye.